relaxed rides through the idyllic French countryside. And heart-pounding time trials. This style of riding is the Jekyll and Hyde of the Enduro world. Half scenic journey, half mad mission to harness speed. Only five days after round one of the World Enduro Super Series, May Madness kicks into high gear at the first classic Enduro of the season, France's Le Trefle Lazarian AMV. The race, now in its 33rd year, has been dominated by French riders since its inception. In the past, French legends like multiple-time Le Trefle winner and Dakar champ Stefan Peterhansel and five-time Enduro world champion Antoine Mayo have made their mark here. 2018 saw Spanish speedster Joseph Garcia claiming third place on the podium behind young gun Theo Espinas and race champion Loic Laurie. Over 550 pro and amateur riders from all over the world and even more enduro fans overwhelm the quiet French town of Monda to take part in a style of enduro that has remained unchanged for a hundred years. Riders are put to the test over three days and each day offers a unique track approximately 200 kilometers long. All tracks feature five special stages where competitors race against the clock. Liaison rides through beautiful mountain valleys, past flowering fields, and historic French towns connect the time trials. The fastest time in the 15 special stages over three days decides the winner, and normally there are only seconds in between riders. In past years, it all came down to the last special stage. Last year, hard enduro pros like Johnny Walker and Manuel Lettenbickler were new to the surroundings and style of riding. This year, they'll be back alongside West champ Billy Bolt, Spain's Alfredo Gomez, and British rider Nathan Watson to put what they've learned from their 2018 experience to good use. New West teams like Britain's Eurotech KTM and the TTR Officine Rigamati team from Italy will contribute additional pressure. Still, all eyes will be on KTM's Joseph Garcia to see if he can best his 2018 third place finish and take the Le Trevlet title, beating out France's many talented classic enduro pros for the first time in 33 years. To see if French dominance will finally end at Le Trevlet Lazarian AMV, and to find out who will take the second 1,000 points at round two of the World Enduro Super Series, visit Red Bull TV.